Hi friends, welcome to Slide Hunt. Today in this tutorial we learn how to delete an element from linear array. Deletion means removing an element from the array. Suppose this is a linear array A. From this array we delete an element. If we want to delete the element from last position then it's very simple. We can delete the last element directly. If we want to delete 9 then just remove the element from the list. But if we want to delete an element from kth position of the array where k is less than upper bound then what happen? Suppose this is another array and this is the kth position. Means here we want to delete this element. So what we do? For this case we need to shift all the elements from k plus 1 to upper bound one position left. Or in other words, we can say we need to shift all the elements from k plus 1 to upper bound from current position to previous lower index. For example, here we shift 8 to here, then we shift 9 to here, and the deletion is completed. Next we see the algorithm. Suppose A is a linear array that has n elements and we want to delete at kth position. Here n equal to 5 and this is the kth position. For this example, k is 2. Our first task is to store the deleted element in a variable. So in step 1, we can write x equal to a of k. This step is optional. If you want to use the deleted element further in your program, then you can use this step. Otherwise, you can skip this step. Next we assign the value of k plus 1 to variable i that is i equal to k plus 1. For this example i equal to 3. In step 3 I am going to write while i less equal to upper bound. If this condition is true then we shift ith position element to its previous location that is a i minus 1 equal to a of i. For this example, a of 3 will be shifted to a of 2. Then we increment the value of i by 1, that is i equal to i plus 1. For this example, i will be 4. Then we again check this condition. If this condition is true, then we execute this two statement again. Here i equal to 4 and upper bound is also 4. So this condition is true. Then we shift a of 4 to a of 3 and then increment the value of i by 1. So now i equal to 5 and upper bound is 4. So this condition is false and come out of this loop. After deleting an element, total number of elements will be decremented by 1. So we set n equal to n minus 1 and then exit. That's it. Next we see how we can implement this using C programming. Here our first task is to declare an array that holds the input numbers. For that I am going to declare here int array and the size of the array is 100. Then we declare other variables also that we use in our program that is num, i and then position. Next, I am going to ask user how many elements they want to print. Print f enter number of elements. We read the input number using scanf function. Scanf percent d and here we refer ampersand num. Next, I am going to ask user to enter elements. Printf enter elements. To read the elements, we use here a for loop. For i equal to 0, i less than num, and then i plus plus. Inside the curly buses, I am going to write scanf percent d and here we refer ampersand array i. Next we print the input array to the screen. For that I am going to copy it and paste here. 
I'm going to write here input array is here I'm going to write printf give here a space and delete the ampersand sign next I'm going to ask user to enter the position of the element that the user want to delete printf enter the position of the element to be deleted next I'm going to write scanf percent d and then ampersand position next we shift all the elements from position plus one to upper bound one position left for that I'm going to write here i equal to position plus one and then I'm going to write while i less equal to num minus one since we store the array elements from zeroth position so upper bound will be number of elements minus one that's why we write here i less equal to num minus one inside the curly braces I'm going to write here array of i minus one equal to array of i and then increment the value of i by one that is i plus plus after deleting an element total number of element will be decremented by one for that I'm going to write here num minus minus next we print the array after deletion for that I'm going to copy it and paste here and I am going to write here after deletion let's check the output compile and run as you can see here it asks for the number of elements I am going to enter 5 enter elements I am going to enter 6 7 9 1 and then 4 input array is 6 7 9 1 4 then it asks for the position of the element to be deleted I am going to enter 3 here we store the array element from 0th position so this is the 0th position this is the first position this is the second position and this is the third position so one will be deleted let's check press enter and now see here one is deleted that's it hope you understand if you have any doubt please comment on the video and if you have any suggestion please tell us thanks for watching to watch more videos please subscribe this channel slide hunt you can like my facebook page at www.facebook.com slash slide hunt and you can follow me on google plus at www.google.com slash plus slide hunt